the syringes. This is a cooker. They'll dump their uh, heroin in there. Then they'll throw cotton to filter it out. They'll use some of the water. This is triple antibiotic equipment for them to put on afterwards. This big van parked on 11th and Indiana streets offers clean syringes to drug users, a program run by Prevention Point of Philadelphia. If you bring in 10 used ones, we'll give you 10 clean ones. Jose Benitez is the executive director of Prevention Point. He says when the organization started in 1992, 50% of HIV infections then were from drug users sharing needles. If you fast forward all of that to last year's numbers, we went from 50% of the cases to 5% which is pretty remarkable. Housing coordinator at the organization Kate Perch says they also address housing needs because most syringe exchange participants are often homeless. You start using more frequently, you have less money, you can't pay your rent. You get arrested because of your drug use. That charge means you can't stay in your family's public housing unit anymore. In addition to the syringe exchange and housing programs, Prevention Point also offers training on how to use NACAN, a medication that is used to reverse an opioid overdose. So they bring in mostly families of heroin addicts, parents, and been able to educate them and give them the Narcan so that if their child um, happens to overdose, they can be the first responder while they wait for the ambulance or the police to get there. Reporting for Temple Update, I'm Lolo Claxon.